Donald Trump will be hosted by the Queen during his three-day state visit to the UK next week. The British monarch and the US president share this very special connection, a royal expert has revealed. President Donald Trump will arrive in the UK on Monday for a three-day state visit and Queen Elizabeth II will personally oversee a state banquet at Buckingham Palace in his honor. The American leader and his first lady, Melania will receive the royal treatment while in Great Britain and all of Trump's children are believed to coming on the trip too. Mr. Trump has a very personal connection with Britain and he and the Queen share a particular passion in common. While Mr. Trump may seem every bit an American, he has Scottish roots and both he and Queen Elizabeth share a passion for the region. Mr. Trump's mother Mary Trump was born in the Outer Hebrides of Scotland in 1912. She emigrated to America at the age of 18 but still kept her Scottish roots alive. President Trump has publicly expressed his love for Scotland on several occasions. In his first UK TV interview as US President, Mr. Trump gushed about his Scottish ties. During the 2018 interview he told broadcaster Piers Morgan that Scotland is a very special place that he longs to return to. Mr. Trump said, the real me is somebody that loves Britain, loves the UK. I love Scotland. One of the biggest problems I have in winning the presidency, I won't be able to get back there so often. I would love to go there. Mr. Trump's love of Scotland is something he and the Queen undoubtedly share, a royal expert has claimed. Royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams told Express.co.uk, Trump's mother was Scottish and obviously there are links there. The reason Trump is reportedly bringing all his adult family on this trip is undoubtedly because he attaches huge importance to his British roots. He also loves Scotland because of the golf courses there. The Queen spends her annual holiday at her Scottish stately home, Balmoral. While Her Majesty receives family and the UK Prime Minister at Balmoral, it's not known for the monarch to invite foreign heads of states there, so Trump is unlikely to ever get a look in. According to Mr. Fitzwilliams, Scotland is a place very close to the Queen's heart. He said, the time the Queen spends at Balmoral has always been a particularly precious period in her year. The royals have always had a particular fondness for Scotland ever since Queen Victoria. Balmoral is the Queen's favorite summer retreat and I think she has always enjoyed her time there. The Queen spends mid-July through to September slash October at Balmoral Castle every year. Mr. Fitzwilliam continued, while it's hard to say where the Queen is happiest, she's able to relax at Balmoral. She's always enjoyed the summer there, holding picnics and receiving royal family members. Spending time at Balmoral is the Queen's tradition. While it's a chance for her to relax, she's also hard at work using the time to look through her red boxes of state papers.